This video is one of a five part series about the five essentials of sailing. See the links in the description below. Trim is about how deeply each end of a boat sits in the water, or more simply, it's how the boat is balanced but in the backwards and forwards direction. We can adjust the trim of a dinghy by moving forwards and backwards in the boat. Using a correct trim will make the boat move through the water efficiently and getting it wrong can slow us down. What we are aiming for depends on the wind strength and our point of sail. In light winds and when sailing upwind, we don't want to push the transom too far into the water as this causes drag. The transom is the back of the boat. Looking over the back of this boat, we can see lots of disturbance in the water and it's also quite noisy. These are the signs that we have drag being caused because the sailor is too far back. By moving forwards in the boat, we lift the transom and reduce the drag. You can see the water is now much cleaner and quieter. What's happening then? Well, when the weight is too far back, the water can't flow away from the back corner of the boat. As the boat moves forwards, the water has to fill the gap behind it, creating the recirculating wave that we literally drag behind the boat. By moving forwards, the bow cuts into the water and the water flows nicely around the boat and away from the stern. Although it's the boat that's doing most of the moving, of course. Sailing upwind here, the boat is trimmed with weight forwards, keeping a full length of the boat in the water and making sure we're not causing drag from the transom. As it gets windier, or by turning further downwind, the boat might be able to start planing. Planing is when the boat sails over its own bow wave and starts to skim along the surface of the water. Here, the boat is planing comfortably, with the bow out of the water and the helm sat back and hiking out. We will still make a wake in the water, of course, but we don't get drag behind us. When we're planing, there's a balance between getting as much of a boat out of the water as possible without presenting the bottom of a boat to the water at too steep an angle. If it's only just windy enough to get planing, sitting too far back will be likely to slow the boat down. In general, the windier it gets, the further back the weight should be. I hope you found this useful. Here are a few more videos you might like. Please help to support the making of these videos by subscribing to the channel. Any questions? Comment below.